Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Gabe with Indigo Software, genuine Microsoft software for less. In today's video, we're gonna be covering the error Windows license key already activated on another device. Now, if this is happening to you and it's not supposed to be happening to you, we're gonna both offer some potential solutions and we're gonna show you kind of worst case scenario what you might wanna do. Before we get into that, if you're interested in genuine Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software. We'll put links in the description box below. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, so we're gonna show you guys a potential solution right now. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna locate our original product key, and we're gonna try to change that within the Windows settings. This is gonna be particularly useful to you if you have a pre-installed version of Windows. If you bought Windows after the fact, you can also find your license key from your reseller. Or if you bought it from Microsoft, you should be able to find it from your account. So there's a couple different ways to find it. If you want a video solely on how to find the product key, go ahead and check that right here. All right, so we're gonna type in CMD and we'll go ahead and run this as administrator. Click yes on the pop-up and we're gonna run the following command. All right, and now the reason I'm not getting a response here is because again, I activated Windows after the fact, after a USB installation on this computer. And so I didn't have a pre-installed and pre-activated software. Now in my case, I just need to dig through my email and find my product key in there. And then once you have that product key, we're gonna go and try to change that in the settings. <coughs> so we'll hit the start menu. We'll go to settings, we're gonna to go to system, and then all the way down at the bottom here, we'll press about. And then here we have product key and activation. So here we can see we have an active uh, status here, but in the case that yours is not working, we can hit change. And then right here, we can uh, control V and paste in that product key that we got from the last step. So just go ahead and paste it in and hit next. And in most cases, this should resolve your issue. All right, so if you're unable to activate Windows after trying those steps, we've now reached kind of the worst case scenario and we're gonna talk through what your options might be. So option one is if you purchased or received your uh, Windows copy directly from Microsoft. If that is the case, we're gonna put a link in the description where you can get on a Microsoft chat support and they can help you to activate your key from there. If you bought it from a third party reseller, you will need to contact them to either get a new key issued or to have them troubleshoot your current key. And of course, if you got it from Indigo Software, our contact link is in the description and we will have it and we'll fix that for you in a timely manner. Now, if you're not really sure where your copy of Windows came from or if you even have a valid key at all, be sure to check out those links in the description. We can pick up Windows 11 Pro or Windows 10 at a great price. All right guys, so that's gonna do it for today's video. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.